Hi, you guys, and happy Saturday. This is Prophetess Afia Sabrina Acapo and wanted to give you a prophetic word that the Lord had spoke into my spirit on today. And as with any prophetic word, you would absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the spirit to affirm and confirm that this prophetic word is for you. And the title of this prophetic word came from the Numbers 333. And the title of this prophetic word is Keys in Threes. Keys in Threes. And as I jump off into the prophetic word, I will as well provide you scriptures that are in relation to this prophetic word that I will be providing on today. So you guys, I've been seeing the numbers 333. And as I was listening yesterday and today at prophetic words, I had a revelation that the Holy Spirit was revealing to me. One for the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Three days is what was confirmed to me. And it dawned on me that through signs, wonders, and miracles... Divine Helpers and Destiny Connections, the Lord is wanting you to know he is giving you keys. And I just heard the Holy Spirit say keys in threes. Whatever you are searching for, it's not going to be through your own access or control. Allow the Lord full access and control to just take the time out to just listen to who the Lord will be sending to you. Do not make decisions out of emotions nor feelings, but wait patiently on the Lord. Make sure he is leading you. Wait patiently on the Lord. Make sure he is leading you. I've given you spiritual keys, physical keys, and financial keys. Matthew 16 and 19, I will give you the keys of the kingdom of heaven. Whatever you bind on earth will be bound in heaven and whatever you loose on earth will be loosed in heaven. The Lord is loosing your keys that have been held up because you are now fully equipped. You are fully prepared and have the capacity to receive. These are no small keys, but large keys because he further wants you to know that he is enlarging your territory. Blessing you indeed. First Chronicles 4. First Chronicles 41 and 10. And Jabez called on the God of Israel saying, Oh, that you would bless me indeed and enlarge my territory. That your hands would be with me and you would keep me from evil. That I might not cause pain. So that no evil will come before you because... He is also expanding your borders. You will be receiving directives, instructions per divine helpers along with roadmaps. So the so allow the Lord to order your steps on that road that you should take. The Lord is giving you your keys to possess your possessions. So the Lord is rewarding you with open door access. The Lord also uses people, the ones he's sending. So when he sends them, be attentive and listen to what they are saying because you will know in your spirit and through those rhema words that will stand out to you and give you insight and clarity. Continue calling him into your circumstances from every array. Because he is the key ingredient that will unlock the doors to your spirit to you spiritually, physically, and financially. Jeremiah 33 and 3. Call to me and I will answer you and tell you great and unsearchable things you do not know. So he is sending keywords, clues, and strategies to obtain what he predestined, promised, and what he purposed for you. No longer will you have to go on a quest because the Lord is enlightening you with keys to his very best. He wants you to rest assured knowing that you can trust him to do exactly what he said he will do. Commune with him and invite him in before making final decisions. No educated guess, no doubt, wandering or guessing. He wants your life decisions 
to unwind from every aspect with him in mind. He wants you to have boldness and confidence knowing that your life has changed. It is not the same because now his hands are in every detail of your life. It's people's places and things that the Lord is using in connection to your keys and threes. And you know what they are. The gifts, talents, and creativity that is already right there. And were there all along. You just had to take the time out to revert back to what was said to you. Even by others that God sent to you in times past. Prophetic words. Those words that were spoke to you. Those keys did not go astray. But... The Lord was waiting on you to be strengthened before the unveiling because this is not going to be in like times past. No, no. The Lord is saying the toiling is no more and you have grasped the concept. Now this is going to be a permanent step. Temporal things are gone, God says. Enough. Your keys are being released because of your faith and my grace and mercy. You now have a deeper revelation, deeper understanding, and you're not just relying on what is going on around you. In Hebrews 11 and 1, it's now faith is the confidence in what we hope for and the assurance of what we do not see. I pray that this word has encouraged as well as edified your life on today. Of the number 333, keys and threes, it has certainly edified, enlightened, and excited my spirit. It has me something, has me definitely with those rhyme words, looking forward to God's absolute best in my life. And I thank him for them three keys. I don't know about you, but them three keys, yes, one for the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. I am in expectation of those keys to unlock. I'm ready for God to unlock. So I'm calling him in. And welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers. Welcome you guys to the fam. So glad to have you here on this channel. I am constantly praying for you. I love each and every one of you. If you have not subscribed to this channel, Press that subscribe button where you can come over knowing that you are going to get a fiery word that's coming straight via the Holy Spirit and through the leading of the word of God that is in Christ Jesus. You're going to get an edifying, enlightening, exhorting, exciting, encouraging word on a daily basis right here on this channel. You can also turn your test into a marvelous testimony. Don't forget to hit that noti bell where you can be notified each time I upload a video. You guys pray that you are having a fantastic Saturday and a um, great and a safe weekend as well. Until the next video, you guys, I will talk with you guys soon. Once again, I love you. I am constantly praying for each and every one of you guys. Until the next video, God bless you. Take care. Talk to you soon. Love you. Bye-bye.